Hello, I'm Jody Wolf. You're watching Expose on July 18, 2017 at 6.42 p.m. Topic, why did the United States black out this report? What you're about to hear right now. And if you recall, I did the secret concentration camps, part two of the prison camps. The same thing Alex Jones has been screaming about for years, and then Agora Road, the dark web, they actually had the executive order from Richard Nixon. Talk about that. Let me let you hear. This is Israeli News Live, the latest report about Ron Paul telling America, and it's been blacked out, you've not heard it, that we're staring right now at a martial law, all because of what you're not being told. Let me let you hear this. It's, it's brief, and um, but here we go. Again, Israeli News Live. Uh, also being reported all across the United States from CNN, Sputnik News, RT News, multiple pedestrians injured after being hit by a car in Boston Logan Airport. It was a taxi cab, no less. Several people are injured after getting hit by this car near the taxi line at the Logan International Airport in the city of Boston, Massachusetts, said police in a statement on Monday. There's not any much more information about it, whether or not it was an intentional terrorist attack or whatever, can't really say. Ron Paul also, he is concerned that we are headed towards a police state, well, martial law, actually. This is what Ron Paul has to say here. On to the militarization of the police force and in combination, you know, with the federal government. And that is, uh, that means that the stage is further being set for martial law. And uh, we have generals in charge of the Department of Homeland Security. Uh, I expect that we're going to have more violence in the cities. I think this is just the beginning of, of what they're seeing in Chicago or Detroit. And if you look at the recent news, how many pension funds are totally bankrupt and the states are bankrupt. And I think it was in uh, uh, Connecticut where... No, Paul, not painting a very uh, good picture for the United States or the U.S. Well, there you go. Short, quick, and simple. Ron Paul it made reference to Michigan or Detroit and Chicago. Look, there's more murders there and deaths there than there is in Afghanistan and Pakistan combined. And the states that are going broke and the pension funds that are drying up, California and the federal government work one year and you retire on more money than you made during that year at the highest point that the pension can give you it will give you but they can't do it long california same thing teachers are being paid more retired than they are working guys i'm just telling you that we could move forward if the liberal left, if the, if the socialist would stop trying to be communist, but they're not going to let it go. So a police state, go back once again to reference what I did about the secret concentration camps and then the part two. Listen to what I say, what I read off there. If that doesn't scare you, then you're one of them. It's true, Jody Wolf exposed.